Hey guys, so today we're gonna do a get ready with me. Um, it's gonna be a quick, just easy tutorial on an everyday look that I've been using just because of the fact that I have been really, really lazy and I don't want to get full glam. So um, we're gonna go ahead and just jump right in and we're gonna get ready for work. Um, first I gotta prime, obviously. I'm just gonna be using the one heck of a blotch instant perfecting power primer um it's just a drugstore primer that's been i mean it's not the best primer in the world but it's it's been doing me some some solids so i'm gonna put <laughs> some a generous amount on my finger warm it up between my fingers and then i'm just going to apply generously to my face um you are gonna just mix this into your skin you know rub it into your skin until um Ah, there it is. Okay. <sighs> now that that's done, I'm gonna wash my hands real quick. Um, what am I doing? I'm using, I'm gonna use a powder foundation today, so I am gonna go in with concealer first. I'm using one of my favorites now, the Tarte Shape Type. Um, this is in the color light. And I'm just going to apply this underneath my eyes where I just want some extra coverage. And I'm going to conceal um, some blemishes I've got. And this thing is like heavy duty. I mean, I'm digging this coverage and it's lighter. Um, and I'm using it to highlight as well. This little bastard. Whee! Everything in that direction. That fucking thing. Whee! We're just going to conceal my entire face. Now that I look fabulous. I'm gonna take a beauty blender and I'm just gonna blend all of it out. Um, Okay, so now that I am concealed, I am going to set my concealer in place um, with some with a banana powder and a vanilla powder from the Anastasia Beverly Hill Contours Kit. Da da da! This is what they look like. They are a little dirty. I'm sorry, but I'm just gonna take a um, F35 brush from Sigma. It's also super dirty, um, and I'm just gonna mix these two together, and I'm gonna set my my face. Whee! It is recommended that you stamp the product into your face and not like swipe it first because when you initially go in you want to make sure that that powder is like setting your concealer and not moving it along. Now, I feel like I've been using that word a lot now, um, but I am going to go in with, I'm, like I'm having the biggest brain farts today. This is obviously foundation. It's from Mick Cosmetics. It's the Celebration Foundation in light medium. Um, I've hit pan hard um, because I've been using the crap out of this the past couple of, I want to say the past two weeks just because I've been super, super lazy and I haven't really wanted to do like deal with liquid foundation and all that stuff and baking. Okay, um I'm gonna bronze my face now. So um just gonna go in really, really quickly with the, oh god, the two, gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna go in really quickly with the Too Faced Milk Chocolate um, Bronzer. Smells delicious, guys. And just a big bronzing brush from, from it. And I'm just gonna just lightly tap it in there. 
tack any, tap any excess off, and I'm gonna go in there and bronze. Now I'm, I'm not doing anything to him. Bron er, I just bronzed my face. Blush, I'm gonna go in with Dallas um, from Benefit and I'm just going to add a little bit of color to my cheeks. One, I'm gonna get some of the color to go away, and two, I'm gonna blend it in with my bronzer to kind of make it seamless. That's why it, that way it doesn't look like stripes, you know, like you've got bronzer, blush, and then highlight. Cause that doesn't look pretty, guys. And trust me, I've done that before. Next um, is highlight, obviously. I just talked about it. I'm going in with this color. It is Glow Kit. Oh, it's called Mimosa. Um, it's from the Glow Kit by, Glow Kit by Anastasia. Um, and the way I use this is I just dip. I don't dip. Like I press this into the product just a couple of times, tap any excess off, and then I apply it to my cheekbones, so like the high points of my cheekbones. And then once I feel like I get the desired highlight, I turn it and then I use the more dense portion to kind of blend it out. And then I make sure to avoid like right here just because I have larger pores. Um, and girl, I'm not, I, I don't want to highlight my pores. I, just, I don't want to do it. They're large enough without you having to see them. I'm trying to cover them, not like be like, bam, you know, like here they are. No, thank you. Um, my face is actually done. Woo! I've got some time left. Um, I am gonna go in. I'll just use my bronzer. Um, my col my eyelids are a little discolored, so I'm just gonna go in with some of the bronzer I used, and I'm just gonna apply this to my crease. And this is just gonna deepen up my crease. Um, and not it's not really doing anything other than that. And I'm not needing it to. I just want to add something to my lids. That way it doesn't look all funky. But I just wanna do something easy today. It's how I've been doing my brows recently. And I'm just gonna go in and I'm gonna make everything seem a little bit more natural than what I normally would. So. Now I'm just going to curl my lashes and we're going to do some eyeliner and we'll be almost done. Lashes curled. I'm going to use my Better Than Sex. Oh God, I feel like I just got too excited to say that. Better Than Sex um, waterproof mascara. And I'm going to apply this to my lashes. Then I'm gonna take my trusty NARS um, liquid liner. I still haven't remembered the name. Something weird. Rue Bonaparte. I don't know if that's actually what it's called. I should probably look that up, but I'll leave the link down below of all the products I use. Um, but I'm just gonna apply this to my waterline. Okay, and then I'm gonna go in with my liquid lipstick. Um, this is in Lolita. Okay, hair is gonna have to do. And then this is gonna be the completed look. So this is just an everyday quick little makeup doing slash get ready with me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like seeing videos like this, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see videos like it more, let me know. Well, don't forget to leave comments down below and let me know what kind of videos you wanna see. 
and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, so that gets really all of it. So subscribe, like, and comment, and we're rocking and rolling. Um, so I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!